My name is Tony Montana. I'm the store manager here at Atomic E6 and I've been working here for almost two years. Working at a vape shop, it's really, really hard. It has its ups and its downs. And it seems to be really tedious, you know, to kind of sit there at the counter vaping a lot and just, you know, kind of dripping juice on coils and vaping. It is, it's a little overwhelming at times, you know. It's, it's hard. I'll tell you what, it's really, really hard. Not everyone can do it. Uh, it's, it's something that you really need to be talented, you know, to succeed with. And, you know, those are the types of things that you need to learn and be educated with and changing coils and cottoning and dripping. It's, it's hard. It's really, really hard. It's not easy at all. At all. What's up? I'm Carl. We're here at Atomic e -Six. I've been working here for a couple months now and um, it gets busy sometimes. Sometimes just helping with customers, doing builds, getting juices and all that. Uh, my manager Tony always kind of puts me on the spot, always asks me to help customers with certain builds, certain new mods and all that. Um, he doesn't do much work himself, kind of just throws it all onto me. Yeah, I'll be there in a sec. Uh, this, I have a lot of juice, dude. Um, even some of the other employees. Uh, it's it's tough out here though. I mean, it's it doesn't seem like it'd be that hard, but it gets pretty hard sometimes. I'm a little busy, I'll be there in a little bit. Okay, uh, I, I, I... We get a lot of customers coming through that we get a lot of stories that come majority of them are pretty boring the stories of oh I got the abusive boyfriend got the abusive girlfriend abusive parents all that I'm just like yeah whatever I mean I'm like yeah that's cool pretty crazy it's like some movie stuff right there but in the end I'm just I'm falling asleep while people are telling me their stories I'm June and I'm a worker here at Atomic E6 it's pretty crazy working here I've been working here since we've motherfucking opened it's all the hard work in here when we're assigned a preferred build, especially like when they're pretty crazy about the ohm wise or resistance wise. They get pretty crazy. Hey, June! June, June, June build! Build! build. Yeah. June, build! June, build! Yeah. June, June let's get some noises. builds! June. Very crazy. Just build a build, come on! June, build it! Hey, June, 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 build! It's pretty hectic, like they walk in, they turn into something else when they give us a preference. They become like one of those things that just like bites your flesh off if you don't get things right and like when they leave it's it's not peace. It's so peaceful. Stop! I'll give you a tip. I'll give you the best tip you've ever gotten. Don't threaten me with a good time. Oh, I am. Don't worry. Hi, my name is Joseph. I'm currently working at Tommy e I've been working here for about three months now. And let me tell you, it could be a pretty dangerous place. I mean, there's wire flying all over the place. I mean, people are sleeping wire, flying at your eye, your neck, your hands. And like, when you're doing coil builds, when you're cleaning someone's coils, you dip in water, and then it's just like, tss, hot, 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 and then, and then with the wire everywhere, you gotta sweep it up, and this, that's a lot of wire. And also, with all the cotton, there's cotton for days all over the place, it's like Mr. Charles. But I mean, it's tough to clean up. Hi, my name is Smith. I pretty much, I pretty much like to help manage these guys by keeping a good eye on them, um, giving them like pointers and tips. Suck it up, guys, Just in case they get stuck in a situation with a customer. Hey, you guys doing a good job. Keep it up, right? What do you say? I pretty much do a lot of talking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I pretty much do a lot of things here that a lot of people don't see. It gets, it gets pretty stressful here, especially when. I'm piled up with a bunch of taxes and paperwork and a, and a bunch of stuff. It's just, it's, it's crazy. It's, it gets, it gets pretty stressful. I can't even take it sometimes. Sometimes I don't even know what I'm doing. 
Hey guys, thanks for watching. I hope you liked that. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe, or you can share it to other friends. Um, if you want to stick around, you can watch a couple tutorial videos we do have. Did I say that right again? T tutorial, tutorial. I said I did, I did say tutorial. I'm a giraffe. Tutorials or vape tricks, and or you can watch a couple more of us uh, some skits and games. All right, all right. Catch you later. Just pick one. Um, here I'm really a nobody. It's it's really not easy. Running a vape shop takes a lot of hard work, dedication, motivation, inspiration. It's hard. I'm still in the bathroom. Hey, uh, I see you guys are sitting really close to each other. Can you guys, like, put your arms around each other while you're at it? Can you guys do me a favor? Can you guys clock out and just leave the customers there? I just want to see what they're going to do. Don't work too hard, guys. You guys are working too hard. Just Can, since, can someone, one of you guys take a break and lay down? That's not a hoverboard. That's an iRobot. It's just cleaning our shop. Leave it alone.